We have a European Data Forum here at Copenhagen Business School. Because of the reasons, uh, rise and in interest um, for open access to data, and especially, as we all know, the number of uh, mainframes, PCs, mobile phones are rising, and so is the amount of data available. That has been labeled uh, big data, but even more, uh, the European Union has a special focus on this, and that's why we have actually allocated two full days here at uh, CBS with a number of keynote speakers, both from the European Union, but also from a number of uh, private and public institutions. The European Data Forum, it is very important because this is the first meeting place of academia, research, business and public sector to discuss opportunities coming from use, management and reuse of data in order to generate added added value at European level, including new jobs and new business opportunities. I am here because I would like to meet in the community and to inform all stakeholders dealing with data on the future policy, infrastructure and research and innovation activities foreseen at European level. The role of the European uh, Data Forum Conference will be to help to develop a European data economy. Now we all know that uh, data become more and more mission critical for the economic future of Europe and of other areas. And currently we see a lot of concentration of this business in America. And uh, we think that it's very important to establish this field also in Europe to make sure that wealth and data that are produced in Europe are also used and deployed for a better future of Europe. Everywhere in the world uh, we experience a growth uh, with respect to the uh, volumes of data that need to be processed and um, businesses and citizens alike experience um, larger and greater challenges in dealing with the volume, variety and dynamicity of data. So in response to this need we set up this event that is meant as a meeting place, as a networking event bringing together all stakeholders, researchers, policy makers, technology providers that operate in the space. This conference is very important for Denmark because uh, we have the presidency of uh, the EU and uh, it is very important to, uh, to uh, share knowledge about uh, how to, uh, to um, offer um, uh, public services uh, across uh, the European countries and uh, this is an event about uh, learning from each other. This uh, increase of uh, data, as we call big data, has a great potential in, uh, in commercializing uh, um, the data for a business purpose. Uh, but it uh, has also a big challenge because uh, a lot of data in public sector is very sensitive. So big data is a hype. I think it's more than a hype, it's a reality. Big data uh, has come out of the research uh, two and a half years ago and uh, according to the different analysts and the uh, different forecasts, uh, big data will be a very important topic. So we are living big data. I've been here for the first day of the EDF 2012. It's been a very uh, informative and uh, interesting set of events today. Quite an eclectic uh, mix of different topics and domains. Uh, we've had uh, some very technical presentations. We've had some uh, very uh, high level uh, guidance and it's been thoroughly stimulating. So I've uh, met some interesting people and I'm looking forward to it next year. This conference really has been quite an eye opener. I'm not sure why we've never had a similar event before. It's great the way we've managed to pull so many different people together from different backgrounds in, uh, in one place. Really good. It has been a great event to kind of meet people. I think all the kind of key people around European data are here. So it would be really fantastic for it to happen year after year and uh, to come here again. Our hope is that we can repeat this sort of event in the years to come. This was a 
EDF 2012, and I hope, of course, we can do the EDF 2013 and so on to keep a strict focus on the opportunities that are within this area.